In this video, let's talk diabetic retinopathy. Diabetes changes the lives of many individuals and families. About 26 million people in the United States have diabetes and are at risk of losing their vision. That's more than the amount of people who suffer from food allergies in the entire United States. First things first, what is diabetes? Diabetes is a condition in which sugar is not properly absorbed in the body. As a result, the sugar builds up and weakens the blood vessels throughout the body. With diabetes, it's extremely difficult to keep your blood sugar at just the right level that your body needs to stay healthy. What is diabetic retinopathy? Diabetic retinopathy happens when diabetes causes bleeding in the back of the eye, called the retina, from the buildup of sugar and weakening of blood vessels. You may be wondering what it means when sugar is not broken down properly. Basically, the sugar that you eat gets broken down into tiny bits that float around in the blood and wait to be absorbed by the cells in your body. With diabetes, the sugar remains in the blood and doesn't get picked up by the cells. This weakens and damages the blood vessels. How does diabetes affect your eyes? Even without diabetic retinopathy, the large amount of sugar in the blood can cause rapid changes in glasses prescriptions. You can also get diabetic retinopathy. This basically refers to the bleeding in the back of the eye from weak blood vessels, which can cause significant, irreversible vision loss. Macular edema may develop as well. This is when fluid builds up in the most important area of your vision, the macula. There are mild, moderate, and severe forms of diabetic retinopathy, which require different levels of treatment depending on the stage. Someone with just a mild case of diabetic retinopathy will begin treatment with careful monitoring of blood sugar. More severe forms of diabetic retinopathy and macular edema may be treated with laser or injections of medications directly into the eye. If you have diabetes, it is important for your eyes to be dilated regularly by an eye doctor to make sure that you stay clear of diabetic retinopathy. You should also make sure to follow up with your primary care doctor to ensure your weight, blood sugar, and blood pressure are controlled. Remember, prevention is the best medicine. Thanks for watching our video on diabetic retinopathy. To find out more about your eyes, come check out our website at eyeinquire.com. We're learning essential medical information about your eyes is now simpler than ever.